Oh, hey, it's the void. Oh, no, it's not the void. It's just low render distance. Oh, God. It is death. It's skellies. It's a skelly. Oh, hey, whoa. There's spawners. Spawners! A skeleton, way to aim, douche. Way to douche, aim. Fuck, where's my... Ah, sh... Die! Fuck. You fucker. Die. Okay, where'd my torches go? I don't care. Just wanna block these off before they start spawning shit. Okay, fortunately they're spawning spiders, not, uh, skeletons. I can deal with spiders. Oh shit, it spawns tw two at once? That's excessive. Whoa, okay, equip the sword. Equip the fuck. Sword. Okay, glad I equipped those amazingly fashionable diamond armor. Ugh. Power of fashion has kept me safe. As it always does. Alright. I'm assuming we need a lever to open this thing. Let's not break the game any more than we already have. It's just so tempting sometimes. And it's just so accidental some other times. Stop that. Stop. Just... Just stop what you're doing. Right now. Okay, you, 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 you all done? Are we cool? I have some more light. You can't put... It'd be cool if you could put the torch on the spawner. I assume I'm not supposed to be able to break the spawner, so let me guess, a lever. Yep. I'm not sure why I keep keeping these random items I find in chests, but I do. Because I just keep thinking maybe I'll need them or something stupid like that. Which would be really mean if you did require me to keep something without some sort of hint as to that I will need it. So I really doubt he would do that. Oh, hello, lava. You're looking stunning as always, Mrs. Lava. The flame... Oh, wait. The flames will cleanse you of your guilt. I... I don't... I don't... I don't like this party anymore. This does... This doesn't sound fun. Oh, holy shit! That was kind of close. Okay. This this sort of precarious lava walking. This I like. Because I can be careful. There's no max distance jumps every single step of the way. Um, it's just something where if you don't pay attention, you can and will die. But if you pay attention, you'll be pretty fine. Because, you know, this is not a platformer. Okay, I can probably turn down. Except the flames. Let me guess, I gotta walk through a lava waterfall really quickly. Oh no, I just gotta walk through actual flames. Also, I really wanna block off that lava and see if it does anything. Your guilt will be washed away by the flames. You've, you've been hinting at that already. Cleanse yourself from the flames. Alright. I will cleanse myself while eating an apple in my stylish diamond armor. Alright, let's throw some useless junk in the fire. Paintings are junk. Kinda wanna throw the gold sword. Eh, fuck it, let's keep everything. Fire. Okay, I probably could have survived that at full health with absolutely zero armor. Okay, this is more scary to me than the flame stuff. Alright, I can see. Kind of. Okay, this... Yeah, this is definitely more scary than the flames. But it looks... Yeah, there's something up here. Is this ice? Okay. Shit. I was like, oh my god, I'm ice Dan. Worst anything ever. Alrighty, yo. Snow! That's certainly odd. It's a ship! I don't get it. This is not a tree of life. That's what I can't see. Torch time! This is one long fucking video. 
Keep thinking the end is like right around the corner though. How did the snow get inside? Let's take a nap. Can we... Honestly, can we end this soon? -ish? It's not like it's been too long or anything. I just... Oh, hey, it's, it's the shit from the beginning of the game. That's what it is. Everything's turned to ash. Dun, dun, dun. I wonder what this could mean. What is the saying? Oh, right. The captain's cabin. Golden got... Golden got... Oh. Yeah. Whatever. Gunpowder. Golden guts. Same thing. I didn't care. What a stylish little cabin this is. Alright. Let's... Oh, the crow's nest is gone. Alright, there's nothing interesting here. I'm king of the world! Alright. No, wait, let's actually do it. I'm king of the world! Ah, derp! Alright. There's a door in here. Probably not supposed to break that. I'm supposed to break that, though. That's what I was talking about with the fairly obvious secrets. Jeez, this map is longer than I expected. You have passed the trials. There are really only a couple of trials, really. But there is one more task you must complete. Look for the sky, for the ground... Wait, what? Look to the sky, for the ground. Has the path you seek. Wait, look to the sky... Why would I look at the sky if the ground has the path I seek? I don't get it. Your riddle is irrelevant. Ooh, Purdy! Look how pretty this is. Oh! Get it? Because the sky is the ground? Because it's upside down. This looks pretty friggin' awesome, though, I must say. Oh, hello. Eat diamond. It is good for your die duster tract. Alright, what am I looking for? It, I'm looking for the answers I seek or something, but... Uh, hmm. I was going to say, is that water? But no, that's probably lapis lazuli. It looks pretty convincingly like water from down here, though. All right, yeah, let me guess. I knew there was going to be some way to climb up to the top here. There's probably going to be zombies. This map has used the, uh, whatchamacallit, the wool, the dyed wool tiles very well. I approve. Also, I really like the touch with the snow on the um, on the rocks and stuff, and in the cabin of the uh, boat. Just sort of a nice surreal touch. That probably really isn't too hard if you use. Um, you can probably get that stuff using InVedit or using MC Edit to edit some, uh, you know, the blocks and stuff. It's probably not that hard, but it's just a nice touch, and it's not something you'd expect to see. So it's cool like that. Also, this, this is pretty badass, but I just like the whole playing with perception thing and stuff upside down. Usually fun. And it's pretty damn well executed, too. You can't make it completely upside down because it's Minecraft. So if you place a door, it'll always be right side up. But still, it's pretty sweet. So, well, that's odd. I think beds must cause this glitch, the blackness glitch. I was also assuming there would be something in here. Um, there's, there's kind of not. There kind of really is not. Is there something up here? Okay, there's not. <laughs> I shouldn't have broken that. Oh, there's a chest. Oh, there's a thing. Thing. There is indeed a thing. Oh, hey, it's daylight outside, by the way. Should have noticed that. Okay. 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 Um. Because of the the update, I'm not sure if I can actually get onto this ladder anymore. So we are going to not quite cheat. Oh, goody, that's the only block I actually had. I'm pretty sure I can't get to this ladder anymore because of the Minecraft. 1.5 update fixed the glitch with the ladders. So yeah, you can't... I'm glad at least 
um, he made the ladder solid, both because it looks nicer and because the glitch would have been annoying as all hell if I had to rebuild this ladder. Shut up, zombies! Just shut your pie holes, your brain holes, or whatever you say for a zombie. Arrows for everyone! Ah! I forgot they did that! <laughs> oh. Alright. Whoa. 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 Let me guess. Tree of life. Oh. Can't see it from here. Tree of life. It's made of glowstone. Life. Life. Welcome to your life. Break off a leaf from the tree, then take the path back to your boat. Gold everywhere. Damn, 50 things of stuff, and some diamond for no real reason, and some gold. Let's trash this trash, that, that, bread. Let's keep a boat. We are supposed to go back to the boat. Let's break off a leaf from the tree of life. And by leaf, I mean... Wait, was this above my boat, like, the whole time or something? Is it one of those kind of things? Max render distance, go. Slow loading, go. I do not see my boat. Is that my boat? Is that my boat? Where's my boat? Someone give me my boat back. I want it. I liked that boat. It was a boat that floated. I like boats that float. You ever seen a boat that didn't float? Those are so useless. Those are the worst kind of boats ever. Splat. Oh, I actually died. <laughs> I thought it would be deep enough to swim in since, you know. Okay. I'm going to call that the ending because I would have just gone back to the boat. All oh, right. I'm going to spawn underground, aren't I? Yeah. See, I made it back to the boat. That's it. That's the end. But yeah, this was a really awesome map. Um, I kind of fucked some things up, but... I didn't fuck up too many things, so I consider it a victory. Also, I seem to have, I'm gonna die again. But yeah, that was a really awesome map. I'd love to see more of it. And if you guys have any suggestions for more maps I should do, uh, just leave them in the comments. All right, so I abused some stuff and uh, <laughs> probably didn't need to, but I was being lazy. All right, so. Got my way back up to the tree thingy there. There are actually things to follow down this way, which I didn't notice until uh, when I came back it was nighttime, so the markers were much more apparent. They wanted me to make them whole and such, of course. So I came over here and I gave myself a bunch of sand and invet it so I could climb back up to stuff. Follow the markers back to your boat. Okay, there is stuff after this then. All right, I just wanted to make sure if there was anything left. Oh, sweet! The captain's key is a button. 
It's better than the lever, I guess. The chest washed up. Oh, God. The chest contains the washed up captain's quarters key. It is so hard to read. Uh. When something's arranged vertically like that, your brain tries to read it vertically, you know, logically. Just, just accept that. You know what, I'll be back when I find the stupid boat. Oh hey, look, we're back in the starting thing. How did we possibly get here? I redownloaded the map because goddammit. I could not find the thing for the life of me. And I wasn't going to keep searching. So... Yeah, I broke it. Whatever. Congratulations, you did it. Read note 20. Ah, great work. You now have a branch from the tree of life. With it, you will help restore your homeland to its former glory. Huzzah! I really can't do a pirate accent. Do ye know there were 40, 58 gold bar? I only missed 9 gold bars. Damn. How many did ye find? Thanks for playing, stranger. So yeah, that is that is world... This is world tree. Also, this chest has a bunch of sugar. <coughs> Quote unquote sugar. Yes. Can I eat sugar? I'm I'm not oh I can't. Well let's sleep in his awesome bed. Okay, let's not. Let's break his awesome bed then. Screw your bed. Screw your couch. Screw your carpet. That felt good. Alright. So I liked everything up until basically after the climax, after you find the tree. Getting back here. Royal pain in the ass. Royal pain in the ass. So, um, making that easier, like, it, if you made the, um, like, if you say made the world tree, like, straight south from the tree, and then you made an arrow pointing north, and just said, walk straight this way, you will find your ship. That would be just great. Especially if it was like a boat trip straight one direction, no obstructions, that would make it a lot less painful. Because I spent like eight minutes trying to get back there. Um, that That's very unnecessary since I basically already beat the game. And all I really came back for was that note. I'm not even really sure why. I guess so, you know, the ending, I'm on my boat and I can go back to my homeland, I guess, is the story there. But still. Or you could make a replica of the boat over there. Um, you know, and just have you go to the replica. Because it really doesn't matter. It just needs to be the boat. Just copy and paste the boat over there. And, you know, I'll find that boat. And it'll be the end of the game. The end just needs to be a lot quicker. But other than that, I really liked it. This is easily my favorite custom map so far. But I haven't played too many. But still... Um, it was really damn good.